All right, the first module, our topic is prerequisites of playing and coaching. So what we do, we focus in in the first two building blocks of our pyramid. And those are body mastery and soccer coordination. Now body mastery is all about the coordination. Agility, reaction speed, balance, all that kind of things. Soccer coordination is combining motoric skills with ball. So those two blocks, we really zoom in, both in lectures, workshops, and in the practical parts on the field. The other side is a prerequisite of coaching, how to deal with kids. So what we do, we go into the age-specific characteristics. What may we expect from certain age groups? And how can we connect kids with kids? And how can we coach them? How can we give them feedback? Now, those are basically the main things of the course. For coaches, it's, it's very good, and for teachers, it's very good to understand these, these age-specific characteristics. And all the exercises we do, they make a fantastic base for every training session. So they can just take it along and have a great start for the training session. I have learned a lot of things, especially how to work with the kids, and uh, no matter how age they are, in uh, different age groups, and the attitude of the coaches, uh, and the behaviors toward the kids. Especially coordination with the, with the football toward the kids. And also I would like to share my experiences when I'm back to Thailand with different coaches and uh, yeah, see how we can go forward with it. I think the main things that stands out from this training methodology is that the emphasis in making all the training drills and all the various training modules fun for the participants. I think that is the most important because most of us Locals, especially, we've been through NS. All, 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 every time we think about PT or training session, it's all the monotonous drill runs and boring, boring training sessions. But I think the key take back from these sessions will be making training fun so that we can retain the interest of the participants and keeping them in the sport as sports as long as we can. Yeah.